Hi, this is Trey Passer, and this video is a, a question video. Actually, um, I have a few titles that um that I I know the description of them, but I don't ex know what the exact titles are. And I would like to uh, get these movies, but I don't know if they're on sale here in the states. I haven't found that they're been on on sale in the states here. Let me explain what I mean. Um, the first movie that I remember uh, watching this was a few years ago. This, I think it's an Australian movie. Um, it's like a comedy romance type of movie. And it's um, the story, basic story is about um, this girl girl band, all girl band, that they come to this small little town in Australia. And uh, it involves, basically the story is about this family. Uh, the father's like a musician, a musician and he's always kind of cheating around on his wife and a uh, long-suffering wife. And he has two young sons. Okay, one is a teenager, of course, an older teen, I guess, and one is a preteen, and and like I said, it's an all-girl band, and I think they're supposed to be a, a, a true like a or a bisexual band, I think, because um, the 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 um, lead singer of this band, uh, you know, the, the father, you know, he's trying to hit on her basically, and and stuff, and so the uh, the older son decides to dress up like a girl, <laughs> believe it or not, <laughs> to join the band to distract the girl from her father, from his father, excuse me, and it's, it's like a comedy, and then of course, you know, you know, what what, what you think would happen, you know, the, the female singer of this band starts to fall for the, uh, the guy that's dressed up like a woman, <laughs> and I, I always, you know, like I said, I saw this movie a couple of times on cable, but I could never remember the name of it, right now I can't, I, I think I, sh I think I tried to th write it down, but I can't remember it whatsoever, and like I said, I don't think anybody famous is in it, or that I would know, but I, I would love to know the title of that movie. So if you know what that movie sounds like, if you've heard of it before and you know what the what the title of that movie is, would you please just, like I said, respond to this video underneath and let me know what the title of that movie is. I really enjoy it. It's like a really enjoyable, uh, you know, comedy and stuff. And it's, and, you know, and it had a great soundtrack to it, too, which the music was pretty good in it. And the second movie um, um, is about a, uh, I think this is an English movie, uh, about two uh, these young guys that are paraplegic and they live in a home you know and and basically they have a caregiver I think all the caregivers are older women at the time you know that take care of them that clean them and and take them for you know wheel their wheelchairs around and stuff and take them and feed them and all that stuff but then a young nurse comes along a young blonde nurse comes along and of course the two, one guy you know the two guys in the wheelchair which are best friends one guy is more cynical and then one guy is sort of naive in a way, and, and of course they both fall for this young, pretty nurse. And of course, I can't remember what the title of this movie is. I really enjoyed it, okay. And I think it was like a real, it's like a drama, and had you know comedy bits in it. But I can't remember what the name of that movie is. And I think it's an English movie, okay. Like I said about the two young guys that are paraplegic. You know, they can't move from the neck down. They can't move, and they're in wheelchairs, and they're being t cared for by this young young pretty nurse comes along and she starts to take care of her and they of course they both fall for her and I can't remember the name of that movie okay and the third thing is um, there's a a movie called um, The Year My Vo Voice Broke okay and it's an Australian movie I know that because I used to watch it on and I think I even had taped it on VHS I have I taped it you know off cable and um, and it was supposed to be three movies uh, The Year My Voice Broke is about a young young guy in Australia growing up of course he's best friends with this with this girl who you know he starts to fall for who's supposed to be his best friend but of course she doesn't see him as a romantic possibility she also sees him as a you know her goofy friend and she starts to fall for an older rebellious type of guy of course much to the chagrin of the young you know her best friend and you know again it's called the year my voice broke and I and I don't think it's on DVD yet because I, I kept looking on the Amazon for it and I think it's only and I got some ridiculous price for it I think on, I think it might be on DVD in Australia or something, but it's for like a ridiculous amount because I don't think they mass produced it on DVD or anything. So if you know a place where they have this movie on DVD, I would love to get it on DVD. Blu ray would be perfect, but I don't think whatever the rights to the movie, I don't know if there's enough interest in it to, to put it, but I love this movie. The year my voice broke about, you know, like I said, a young guy. And the actor, young actor in that movie, his name was Noah Taylor, and they made a sequel to it called uh, Flirting movie called Flirting, which actually had some future stars in it. it had Nicole Kidman in it, uh, um, Thandie Newton, 
And also, uh, uh, hold on, let me think of this. Wait, hold on, I'll tell you exactly what her name is. I can't remember her name now. Uh, uh, Naomi Watts, a young Naomi Watts in it. Um, basically, this is like the sequel to A Year My Voice Broke. And uh, it's, uh, it's, it's called Flirting, and it's about, you know, the Noah Taylor, his character, that he goes to boarding school. And, um, of course, uh, he starts to fall for this young African uh, immigrant girl that's in, in Australia, and her name is, you know, Thandi Newton plays this young, you know, the young African girl he falls for, and it's a really sweet romance and stuff. But if you look on Amazon, <laughs> they have a picture of Thandi Newton looking at Nicole Kidman, a young Nicole Kidman. And if you look at the, you know, the title, it says flirting. So if you look at from the just seeing the box cover, you just think, oh, she's flirting with Nicole Kidman, which is not the case. But I guess the, the filmmakers wanted to cash in on Nicole Kidman because she became a bigger star since that movie was made. You know, and so they, they want to make it seem like the movie's about her, but it, it's really not. She she plays a part in it, but she's not the main focus of the movie. Okay, and like I said, she's in it. Uh, Danny Newton, who's more of the main character, with Noah Taylor. They're the ones that have the romance. And then, of course, Naomi Watts plays one of the young friends of Danny Newton. Okay, and um, so that's another that's another movie. But the main reason I bring that movie up, you know, uh, I can get that movie. That's not, not a problem. The problem is there's supposed to be a third movie made. This is supposed to be like three movies, but I don't know if they ever made a third movie to this. You know, like I said, the first movie was The Year My Voice Broke. The second movie was um, Flirting. And I think there was supposed to be a third movie, when he, I guess, when he's out of school and he's young and he's on his he's supposed to be a young adult but I don't know if they ever made it I don't think they ever made it at least I didn't think so I mean they might have that's why I'm again putting this out there in case it did come out maybe in Australia or something and this just never was widely released or anything so and like I said no tell I don't think he even acts anymore I mean I can look it up to see but I don't I don't remember him being anything else okay um so and that's the that's and then the, the last thing um uh, I want to see if anybody figures this out. Um, is uh, there was a movie I saw on cable? I used to watch, like I said, I used to watch movies on cable all the time. Um, there was a movie uh, about a, a. I think this movie is supposed to take place sometime during um, World War II, and I, I think I'm not positive about this, but the movie was shot in black and white about a young French girl who has a romance with a American black GI, and I can never remember the name. I think it was, I saw it on an independent film channel. Like part I came in like in the middle of the movie, and then I think I had to leave, and I didn't. I never got to know what the title of the movie was. Okay, and like I said, it's about a young French woman, girl. I think that she has a romance with a young black GI, and it was shot in black and white, and I think it was filmed probably in the 50s or the 60s. And I cannot for the life of me remember what the title is because, like I said, I don't think I ever got the, quite got the title of it. So if anybody knows what the title, is, I would truly, truly appreciate that, and I can look that up and maybe get that movie and see it from beginning to end. So. That's my that's my questions that I want to put out there to anybody, that, and I appreciate anybody in the YouTube community that could respond. And if they know, like I said, um, the first thing, the first movie, like I said about the the girl band that goes to the small town, and the guy dresses up like a girl to infiltrate the band to distract the girl from her father, from his father. I don't know what the name of that movie is. <laughs> that's an Australian movie. And then the second movie, again, is I think an English movie about these paraplegic guys that you know they're in a home and they're being taken care of by by nurses and then a young nurse comes along and of course that they both fall for okay and I can't remember the name of that one and um, the third thing is uh, the uh, this trilogy of movies that were supposed to be made you know like the year of what my voice broke I want to know if that movie is on DVD now and uh, and then flirting is the second movie then there was a third movie that was supposed to be made but I don't know if it got ever got made and I want us to know maybe somebody knows if it got made or not and then the fourth movie is like I said um, I don't know what the title is, but the story, basic synopsis of the story is a young French girl has a, I think she has a, a romance with a American black GI during World War II. I think that's the period, but I, and I think this movie is, the movie was filmed in black and white, I know that. And I think it was filmed in the 60s sometime. I don't know if it has, sub, I don't think it has subtitles on it. Okay, it, it may have, I, I can't even remember that part, but if that sounds familiar to you, like I said, please leave your answers below in the description below I mean in the in the responses down below I truly truly would appreciate that and this is Trey Pastor saying uh, thank you for all any help you can provide me I truly appreciate it and Merry Christmas again still Christmas <laughs> uh, Trey Pastor saying so long and take care